Well, diversity, you know, there are big companies around the world and countries who've been focused on this for decades. Uh, we're a little bit behind when it comes to private equity and venture capital specifically. Good news is uh, we've started some initial efforts. The good news is they are having some results, which is surprising in such a short period of time and that within a couple of years, ratio of female founders are up. Are up. We're beginning to see more firms with senior female leaders in them. The numbers are still pretty low, so the good news is we have a lot of room for improvement, but we're showing that efforts matter, and limited partners are really joining with us now, particularly with the efforts of the ILPA Institutional Limited Partners joining us. They're really now part of the chorus, and we're all really starting to figure out together, you know, it's diversity, it's everybody working together, um, how to change the, the demographics of the industry for the better. The question of where we are in the venture market is always the eternal one. We tend to be manic. We, it's either so wonderful or it's never going to. It's never been worse. Um, it's been so wonderful for a long time. I keep thinking this is the peak, and I've been saying that for three or four years. Um, there is a lot of ex outside capital in, and I think that's keeping valuations high. It's also keeping companies private longer, but it's also allowing them to grow outside the glare and the short-term focus of public markets. It's a good and a bad thing. Uh, the good news is the returns in 2018 across the industry were record-setting, the best in the last 10 years for M&A and IPO. It's all about cash on cash to our limited partners. I can be excited about any startup, but until I return my limited partner's cash, it hasn't gone well. It's been a good year. Um, and the good news is we don't see too many startups funded. And while we all love to see more seed corn, the fact there aren't too many startups means that our supply demand is, is in a good balance. So hopefully if prices moderate, uh, we'll come through this okay.